We are Sign Surf, and we're driving sustainable change in the surfing industry. Surfboards are currently made almost entirely from petrochemical based materials. The average surfboard creates twice its weight in unrecycled waste in the form of plastic foams and resins. With the average lifespan of a surfboard being only two short years, this amounts to over 200,000 tons of global plastic waste every year. It's causing irreversible damage to our oceans and ecosystems. But what if we could make surfing truly sustainable? At Science Surf, we're making the world's most sustainable surfboards. We've replaced plastic foam cores with hollow timber structures and use only one third the amount of resin, that is 26% plant based. Our surfboards create less than 0.5 kilograms of waste, are more than 95% biodegradable, and are better than net zero emissions. They are not only sustainable, but high performance. Being less than 15% heavier than conventional surfboards, they are also flexible and far more durable too. These characteristics completely reinvent what is possible with a wooden material. They are made locally in Sydney, Australia and are sold at equivalent prices to other locally manufactured boards. So how is this possible? Well, through months of prototyping and testing, we have developed a new hollow structure, a new nanosilica bioepoxy composite and a new CNC machining method that reduces the manufacturing time of a hollow wooden board by 70%. Each of these developments is now patented and the process's automation will allow us to scale quickly and effectively. But it doesn't stop there. We're also branching into surf accessories, starting with our molded cork traction pad. The global surfboard market is valued at $6 billion, while the Australian market is worth $750 million. We will focus on longboard, mid-length and fish surfboards, leaving a market portion of approximately $300 million which will grow as we branch out to other countries and as we develop surf accessories and other related products. We are gaining a customer base through our socials by attending surfing and ocean related events and through collaborations, such as with industry legend, Steve O'Donnell, with whom we have been working to produce his surfboard shapes with our technology. Science Surf is being built by myself, Emil Teo and Alistair Pilly. I'm a part-time engineer and recent graduate from the University of Sydney in chemical engineering and nanotechnology, while Alastair is an environmental science graduate with experience in CNC machining and robotics. At ScienceSurf, we are innovating to make a sustainable wave in the surfing industry.